Okay. And I lived a good, quiet life. I was a shy girl, timid, shy. I was used to the, my animals were my friends. I had a pet pig. Most kids have pet dogs or cats. I had a pet pig. What was his name? Pinky. Did he come when you called him? Oh, he was by my side all the time. Wow. And all of a sudden, Pinky grew up. Got too big. <laughs> and I come home from walking home from school. And I heard my father say, here comes Ruthie. Get her out of here. Uh -oh. They had Pinky upside down. All the men, the farm members they, were there. They harvested up Pinky. Well, Pinky had a good life. Yes. Pinky had a good life. Yes. He right. was my friend. Yeah. Yeah. I had a rat in college as a pet rat. <laughs> his, name, his name was Clyde. And we had him for four years, and he ate pizza every night and drank schnapps when it was time to go to bed so he wouldn't bother us in the middle of the night. Oh, and in the fourth year, he was kind of too big. Nobody really could take him. So he met our next door neighbor's pet, the boa constrictor, who oh. ate him. Oh, no. <laughs> so we have a similar story. Yes. <laughs> yes. But he had a good life. I ha Yes. He drank beer and schnapps every night after his pizza. He liked no. pizza crusts. Is that right? Yes. No, I never was a drinker. <laughs> well, I, Clyde, the rat, was a the drinker. A quiet life. All right. I never knew what beer, liquor, or anything was. I grew up with uh, yeah. my father would take us when we got older in the car. I have to, another question for you. In school, in elementary, in, in, in grade school, Yes. In science or whatever. Yes. What did they teach you about the Earth? Did they teach you that it was flat? Or yes. They taught yes. you that the Earth was it, flat. The Earth was flat. And stationary and does yes. not move. Yes. And then later in your life, they said it's a spinning globe. Uh, to this day, it's hard for me to believe it's round. It's not. It's flat. It is? It, it's flat and doesn't move. And they're hiding that information from us because they're hiding God. They don't want you to know that we lived in an intelligently designed, created flat earth. Isn't that amazing? Amazing. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'll show you when, when I'm done talking um, how it works. But if you look at water, water, the oceans are ocean sea level. Level right. means flat. Right. right. And if there was a curve, things would go behind the curve, but that's they don't. Like when you see a boat disappear behind the curve, that's just because of our eyes can't see it anymore. You get a zoom camera, zoom in, there's the boat again. Oh no. Yeah, and the sun goes down. Right. Just because if this was the sun, watch, here's the sun, right? Right. And, I, and the sun's just gonna go away. Look, it's that's setting. That's right, that's it's what it was. Uh, that, that's one thing that amazed me. It's flat, and you were right to question it. I yeah. So I'm a researcher, and I research all, lots of things, and someone told me about Flat Earth, and I told them they were crazy, right? Because I grew up. I grew like, up with Well, you grew up knowing it was flat. That's but, right. But in kindergarten, they told me it was a globe, so I believed that my whole life. And then finally, I tried to disprove Flat Earth and prove yeah. the globe. There's no proof of the globe. Oh, no. There's none. It's flat, which is good. It's a good thing because you know what that means? The globe, for the globe to be real, that means the Big Bang Theory. You know about the Big Bang Theory? Right. It means nothing exploded and created everything. We are random specks in the middle of a giant universe and there's no God. But a flat earth intelligently designed means yeah. that we I, are the center of creation. Right. We are important. Right. This I'm is, a church lover. The Bible is a flat earth book. There's a book. That's you, right. There, there's, there's. A, <laughs> That's a, right. I had a big Bible. And yeah. My husband was a very religious man. 
we, so you know, you know, you know many verses of the Bible. Yes, so, I do. The entire Bible is a flat Earth book. There's over two hundred proofs of the flat Earth. That's right. Isn't that amazing? Yes, it is. <laughs> um, yes, it is. Would you be willing to do a quick video? with a friend of mine who's a flat earth researcher, I, I am, but he knows all about the Bible and we could ask you a few questions. Oh yes. We can do it right now, right here. And my husband was more, he used to, we had to go to church. I grew up with a family that were church goers. Yeah. And my husband was such a good man. He taught Sunday school children wow. the Bible. So the Bible talks about the earth being stationary and does not move, and yeah. God separated the waters from the waters. In that's this, right. That's in the beginning, and, and and created the firmament, which is the dome that's over the flat that's earth. That's right. And the heavens above are I probably was, water. When I first moved to Florida, I used to watch the sun go down. It's just going away. Look, here's the sun. Watch, this is the sun, watch my hand. And as it goes away, it looks like it's setting. Yes. It's exactly what it is. It's all perspective, and that's why it goes away. Oh, my. And, and then when you tell somebody this today that's been brainwashed their whole life. Yes, is it the sun? Looks they say, what about boats over the horizon? Well, we've debunked that, like super zoom cameras. And the sun setting, we've explained that how That's right. how magnification, atmospheric magnification makes it look like it's going down. Right. There's no there's there's I, I say there's three baskets when you have a, a something. It fits only works on a flat earth, only works on a ball earth, or could work on both. Yes. Right? Nothing yes. goes into the only works on a ball earth. Nothing. There's zero things that go into the only work on a ball earth basket. We were taught that it was flat. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. Yes. Um, I'm going to call my friend Nathan right now, and we're just going to do a quick video. Is that okay? And Because I want to document this, because there's not many people left that yes. remember this. Yes. Let's, um, let's do it. Let's go over here where there's a little more light, okay?